What's up, Vikes? I'm Allie, and this is your Monday Report. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. If you are interested in joining the auxiliary dance team, I caught up with Coach Schultz to learn how tryouts are going to be held this year. Let's check it out. Hey Vikes, I'm here with Miss Schultz to talk about auxiliary dance team tryouts, so take it away. Yeah, auxiliary dance team tryouts um, are going to be virtual this year. So um, there is a packet that people can access on the auxiliary page on the band um, Seaman School website. Or you can go to tinyurl.com slash oxpacket2, the number two. Um, And they can access the packet, and that has all of the information of what tryouts are going to be like. The material will be sent out on May 4th, and that is when the packet is due. Um, And then once everyone submits everything, then I will send the packet out and that will have the video material. So the dancers will learn the video and then they'll submit a video as well. Um, And so they'll have two weeks to learn the material and submit a video. So, yeah. Okay, awesome. Thank you so much. The tryout packet has been posted on Schoology. Make sure and check that out if you're interested. The Writing Center is looking for more consultants. If you're interested in this job, there is an application posted on Schoology. Email Ms. Sands if you have any questions. Due to the school closure, gatherings in the parking lot or on school grounds will not be permitted. Please stay home and stay safe. Seniors, if you want to speak at graduation, there is an application that is due next Friday. Email Ms. Welsh if you have any questions. Now over to Josh with the weather after this quick commercial break. Good afternoon. A little bit of rain the past couple mornings, but we have a great day on the way for tomorrow. Morning temperatures in the 40s, but we will quickly make it back into the upper 60s, maybe even touching 70 by tomorrow afternoon. And it's all thanks to an area of high pressure that's going to keep the winds light and our skies clear. So a sunny day is on tap for tomorrow. But then on Wednesday, we'll watch an area of low pressure develop in Oklahoma. And the position of that is important because that's going to keep the severe weather threat to our south. However, we could still see some of the moisture from this system on Wednesday by 9 o'clock in the morning, an area of precipitation lifting in from the north. Notice it's not all too heavy, and we're not expecting lightning or thunder with this, but some showers would be possible, especially into the early afternoon hours. That may end up being our highest chance of rain. And then by the evening, this starts to shift out. So again, scattered showers possible on Wednesday, but the better chances will remain to our south. And checking out the SVTV 7-day forecast, it shows a overall a pleasant stretch of weather continuing, especially on Thursday, 75 degrees. And once again, we'll have sunny skies. Watch for a few storms Thursday night into early Friday morning. Still a little bit of uncertainty in that period, but then the weekend looks dry and pleasant once again with highs in the mid-60s. Now, Allie, back to you. That's all we have for today.
hate this chill. Now, now! 